guys, so the intro for this video is um, with me driving and you basically can't hear a word that I'm saying. So I just wanted to kind of let you know what's going on in the video before I just like shove you right into it. So basically, uh, Michaela and I were kind of out and I had an infusion. So I decided that it would be a good idea for me to bring a second person to my infusion so that, you know, she could kind of record some of it so that I have it for future reference because eventually I'll probably be doing these at home by myself uh, with a port or a pick line or something. So we wanted to record kind of like how it works and I figured that, that would be an interesting video for you guys because usually when I do my infusion vlogs, all you see is like the few seconds between. You don't really see the actual process. So I will warn you that there is going to be needles and there is going to be tubes and we're in a hospital. So um, if any of that bothers you, I'm very sorry. You can scroll on past. You, I'm just, you're not getting a video today. I'm sorry. <laughs> um, I don't mean to be rude or anything, but you know, I am disabled. So some of that stuff is going to come up on here sometimes. So um, if that's not for you, totally understand. Just click, click on and we'll see you later this week or next week. I don't know when this video is going out. But um, otherwise, those who are, you know, possibly looking at getting infusions or who do get infusions and, you know, maybe you just want somebody who shares the experience or something or you're curious as to how it works, this video is for you. Hopefully this will give a better view into what the infusions are like compared to when I vlog them myself. So see you guys in there. I've never been to a daytime infusion, I guess. So I've never been here during a daytime infusion ever. Um, the only time that I've ever come is always when the only thing that's still open is the infusion center. So, this is really weird. There we go. So we're in the infusion center. There's my... Oh, oopsies. There's my chair and my pump and everything. And um, Michaela's in my little private restroom over there. Um, and then I'm gonna go to the bathroom and then we'll be ready. They did my vitals and everything. So everything seems normal for right now. <laughs> so, um, well, I guess my blood pressure is a little bit low, but it happens. Um, so I am gonna get my uh, infusions in just a few minutes. How's your cranberry juice? They put ice in it, isn't that fun? Yeah. They always have really good cranberry juice. We pay good money for the fancy share. <laughs> Actually, my infusions are 100% covered, so I don't pay anything for them, but... Well, I pay five bucks every time I came because it meant that I got to be in like a really like like a massage chair or something. Just not hooked up yet. I don't know what that means. This is a uh I think it's like a crash cart. Let's see. Rocking supply cart. Oh, so it's just a bunch of like tools. I've never had one of those in my room before. It's got like two <laughs> That's what she's talking about. I won't show the barcodes because. Peace sign. Say hi Sorry. to the internet. <laughs> <laughs> so, would you go like right here and sit right there? I think or I would up? probably. I feel like it. I have really, really weird everything. I would probably disorder. go um, in the center, so a little bit um, more central than where you inserted. So go okay. through, kind of right there. Okay. Yep. Okay. Ready? Mhm. Mm blood return but not a ton. Yeah. Guess that's not helpful. <laughs> well 
it can just mean that maybe it's up against the wall of the vessel or mm -hmm. you know for some reason it's not really giving us a lot of blood back so we only want to use it if we've got blood return and then mm -hmm. we can flush easily that's kind of the sign that it's in a good spot um i maybe think mm -hmm. see it always feels weird to me when they move it in and out and in and out uh, at this point, that they have to do that kind of every time, so... Yeah, I think you might have... Oh, light's out! I think it might have um, blown, actually. Yeah. And, yeah, see how it got a little swollen yeah. like that? That, 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 happens, yeah. that happens almost every time, oh. to be honest. Look at your vein Sorry. now, it looks like it's like... Hey, did you did you did, did you, you need mind? something? Hello. <laughs> Hi. Yeah, we needed that to work. Oh, man, I'm sorry. Here's a little two by two. You want to just put a little pressure on that guy? We can put some tape on it. Yeah, I yeah. think it would just oh, kind of collapse. That's fine. Ah. I know you're it's used not like to it that. Ha but it's happened before. It, we hate it's it happened every to time. it's it's happened to me maybe every other time I come. Oh, okay. Oh, I'm sorry. It's really it's fine. Like literally, it's literally not that big of a deal. They I collapse all that. the time. I'm That's seriously still, not even kidding. It still stinks though. Well, <laughs> we don't like to. Well, I didn't know that these ones were here anyway. Well, so. <laughs> extra holes in you. Yeah, so. we're glad we found extra them. holes? Yeah. Are you kidding me? I get piercings <laughs> all the time. Okay. Well, good idea. They're a little thinner. Yeah, a little bit thinner here, and maybe a little deeper, because sometimes if they look, mm -hmm. look like that lighter um, kind of coloring can show that it's maybe just a little deeper in the skin. I know they've so, done that one back here before. That one back there, yeah, that one. But it's been a while. So let's see if we can. Or even like, I don't know if that side yeah, might be we'll, better. We'll check the other side too. That one is a contender, but we'll look over here and see if there's a better one. Right? See, there's so. my per there's my perfect hole up there. Did you see it? <laughs> there it is. <laughs> what is that? That's they, her vein. They blew right it last there. time. Oh, so that's what it looks like when it's gone. It literally just looks like a circle. <laughs> well, I mean, they sometimes they come back, but um, not with you. Not that one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that one uh, probably just needs some time to heal. I mean, I can feel them under the surface. How long has it been, Gab? But just last time? A little need. over a month. Yeah. But I have the collagen stuff makes it so that sometimes they, they, they heal really slow. If I have to take my watch off, I can too. Oh, no. I'm just seeing if maybe there's one on the back side that we haven't thought about yet. But we've got a fragment there, but it doesn't look super, super strong. Do you think it's on for again? I actually would use a 22 for this one um, because I think you're going to need the, the length. Yeah, because this vein is long and looks pretty strong, but you know, looks can be deceiving, right? We'll find out. Yeah. <laughs> what we happens when all of them in the armor got? Do you start with the leg? Does the leg have veins? Um, usually, we don't use the leg. <laughs> yeah, they don't. They don't end up down there usually. The vein says, excuse me, excuse me, these cakes. There we go. That's a little better. That's good. We'll have to see how it flushes and everything. You'll have to let us know if it feels okay. That looks good. There's some blood. Yeah. Yep. I'm flush. Yeah. yeah. Pain, sharp pain with that? Or nope. It feels like it's... She has no feeling. Yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, I mean, no, I don't. It doesn't feel like it normally would when it stops. Yeah. Sometimes, uh, usually, well, I won't say all the time, but most of the time, if something's wrong with the IV, the you patient feel like it knows. hits, like yeah, you feel it something hurts. Yeah. Basically, what what would happen is like it feels like it, it feels like like you're getting a shot where you mm -hmm. can like feel it not necessarily you know mm -hmm. go through correctly. Not that shots are bad or anything. Get 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 vaccinated. <laughs> Everybody, please get vaccinated. Tuck, tuck in there. Oh look, we bought you from the store. Look at that. <laughs> I've been purchased. <laughs> You've been purchased. Saline and the everything goes well together. Yeah. yeah. Machine, you know.
I'm kind Find of something. in the middle of something. <laughs> I only put a, a few minutes of delay on there. I should have put longer. And now you can tell it's working because I can smell alcohol. So this is the, the tortoise smells like alcohol. Go, um, Fran. Yep. No, the and saline flush smells like alcohol. Five minutes. Okay. Right. Tortoise doesn't smell like anything. Hello, bag. So some more saline. I'm gonna get a thousand mils, not five hundred. I'll take the five. <laughs> Okay. I always it. need saline. I have pots, so I always, I always need liquids all the time. Or kind of combo they've decided would be good. It just does depend on the person, but for the most part, you can see a very similar like cock, we call it the cocktail, <laughs> cocktail to yours. That's really fancy. It tells you what's going on. There. The inside of the line is purple. Well, that's the color of the tube, I think. Yeah. Um, uh, I actually do not know. I don't know if it's a branding thing or what. But they are purple. Branding. Branding. You know. Branding. Medicine is a business, although we wish it wasn't. Oh, you put it to continue just to suck the rest of it out. Yeah, I like to. Give everybody the last drop. Go to the last drop. Yeah, man. Got it. So that was kind of my infusion, and there's the pump with everything taken out of it and everything. So there's that. There's my chair and everything. My cup, all that stuff. So we are about to head out. Um, the kids are going to the bathroom, and then we're gonna head home. So see you in a few minutes. Hello, so we are now leaving the infusion with my one blown vein and <laughs> The other one, we checked on it. I don't know if we filmed it or not, but we checked on the other one that blew the last time I was here, and it's still blown, so... <laughs> Yay! Um, they found one okay one, though. They found one good one. We did that one, so... Yep! <laughs> we got one left. We did that one. It didn't blow, so... You know. So, we are now heading to um, the dollar store, because i got to pick some stuff up like new brakes <laughs> um great we need to get you a new brake. that's that's what my infusions are like we were i think we were um the actual infusion goes on over an hour and then um other than that like the setup is like maybe 30 minutes so it's like an hour and a half now how do you feel about how how do you feel about how that went do you think that that's something that you would want to do michaela yes. If it helps, I wouldn't want to put myself through all the effort if it doesn't work, but I think even sailing would be something. Well, you know what I mean? I In guess. terms of keeping hydrated. Yeah. Because typically when I go to the ER, um, and I get saline, there's usually about, like, I'm good for a week. I have, like, 
I'm actually thirsty for once, I've got a ton of energy, and I'm able to keep up with drinking water. But it only lasts for like a week, so. Maybe she'll end up with infusions, you know, we'll find out. Like my doctor doesn't want me to be, be any more disabled than I am. <laughs> so yeah, that's kind of how infusions work. Um, basically, you know, there's the prep and then you sit there for a while and then it's done. Um, and they take everything off. Uh, so they check your vitals at the beginning and at the end and yeah. So thank you guys so much for watching my little uh, teeny tiny infusion vlog where I show Michaela what an infusion is like. Um, and if you guys have any questions, Big you can leave them down below and I will, I will answer them. Mm. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys whenever I make next. Big boat. Okay, bye.